The Miami Heat trying to bounce back from a series set back in Boston. The Dream Team unable to get past the seas in game three. Well, now they are back at practice. Practice makes perfect after all. Gearing up for the next game, sports director Steve Shapiro yep, live in yep, yep, Boston yep. with more. Steve? Rob, they just finished practice. They could actually walk back to their hotel. We're at Emerson College in downtown Boston. Take a look at the headlines on the sports page in the uh, Boston Globe. Elbow room. Rajon Rondo, you know, dislocated his elbow in game three last night, got pushed or got tangled with Dwayne Wade. And today, Wade is getting ripped by the local media, especially on the radio. They think he did it on purpose. Practice this afternoon for game four tomorrow night. But all the chatter today about the game last night. Dwayne Wade accused locally of being a dirty player after he and Rajon Rondo got tangled up and Rondo dislocated his left elbow, bracing his fall. I'm not a dirty player. The replay is nauseating. I knew right away something was wrong uh, when I went down, but you know, thank goodness, thank God for Kevin, because I was having trouble breathing. You know, I was worried about my elbow, but I was having trouble breathing. He just, I just kept hearing him tell me to breathe. Rondo disappeared, his left arm dangling, but the one-armed bandito returned and played the entire fourth quarter. I still haven't seen it. I've, I've heard that I don't want to see it. Probably it helped me, honestly, that I didn't see it uh, because if I had of a from what I hear, it had been tough for me to put him back in the game. Rondo is an inspirational hero, and Dwayne Wade is perceived as the villain, forced to defend himself that he intentionally tried to hurt Rondo. You know, it's physical. Uh, everyone falls to the ground. Everyone gets hurt. People get up. Rondo, we're told, was in greater pain today, but last night his adrenaline took over his mouth. You know, we show up, you know, Monday night and we're on the court and we're playing. You know, don't ask me how I feel. I, I'm going to play regardless. Yeah. I'm not going to use that excuse and we're no excuse team. You know, uh, he did not practice today. He went for an MRI. He was in a lot of pain. Now it looks likely that Rajon Rondo will not play in game four tomorrow night. The Heat will show up. Any suggestions what I can do with this? Fish wrap or something? I don't know. We'll be back in sports. Talk a little bit more about Game 4 tomorrow night. Steve Shapiro live on the streets of Boston, 7 News.